In this video, we arrived in Tissa, which means that we will go on one of the best safari in Sri Lanka, the safari of Yala National Park. Join us as we make our way into Tissa, the town next to the park, spend the night there, and then embark on the morning safari in Yala National Park. Be ready, as we were super lucky, and even so most of the big ones, leopard, sloth bear, elephant, and so much more. All right. Let's get started. To get to Tisa, our hotel organized a driver to pick us up in Ella in the afternoon. We arrived at the end of the day and checked in at La Safari Inn. We opted for that hotel as it had really good reviews, both for the hotel and the safari. In bonus, the room price was also great, as we were looking for something not too expensive, as we would barely be staying one night there as our safari starts at 4.30 am. Once settled in, we went around Tisa. There wasn't much to do, but we saw the Yatala Stupa and the Fruit Bat View Pond. After that, we hanged around and then headed to Smoky Kitchen for dinner, which had nice vibes and it was cool to see them cooking in the old pots. Right, okay, so we went out for uh, dinner. They don't have alcohol, they don't have beer there. But you can just go to the wine store. It's located like one minute walking away. You buy your beer and you go back. So let's see. Well, I got myself a beer for 470 rupees. And now I'm going to go and drink it in the restaurant there. Cheers, Tina. Oh. <laughs> no, no, Tina, Alex. come here, don't run, just walk, just walk, don't run, you never run, ah, you are stepping on me buddy, and here we are, <laughs> walking somewhere in Sri Lanka, Get we, lost. we followed Google map, brought us somewhere, brought us nowhere actually, there were no road, nothing, ah. And uh, we just have to walk all the way back, everything we did, so instead of a 15 minute walk back to our accommodation, well I guess it's going to be a 45 one. And it's crazy crazy hot here, it's, we are drenched. Well I must say that it's uh, beautiful actually. Amazing. Yeah, we walk in nature and surrounded by firefly. You will look at this uh, tree. Well, there are hundreds of them. And here our safari starts. <laughs> at 4.30. And, and we woke up at 4.20. Yeah, basically that our alarm, we had uh, like two alarms, one at 3.45, one at 4. Uh, well, none of them worked. <laughs> I don't know, because maybe of the sleep mode of the phone, it didn't work. I just woke up, I checked the time, it was 4.20, woke up and I said, wow, we have to go. We packed everything, went, went quickly to the toilet and chub chub boy, we are right on time. <laughs> that day, we were with a cool crowd of three other people. Once everyone on board, we drove until the ticket office of Yara National Park. There, we waited in the jeep while the driver got our tickets and then went to the main gate. That was still closed when we arrived, as the Yala National Park only opens at 6 am. Slowly the sun rise and the park opened. We were some of the first to enter it that day. We right away started spotting some of the common animals and birds of the park. However, we quickly got lucky and saw a sloth bear, which is one of the rarest animals to see. We then continue around the park, and not too long after, we spotted a leopard. Unfortunately, I wasn't quick enough to record it. We then spent some time around the area where we spotted the leopard, trying to see him again, but it didn't happen. At least, we saw lots of beautiful birds. We then continue exploring the park, 
where we saw peacocks, mongooses, monkeys, buffaloes, deers. That's Sri Lanka national bird. And right before lunch, elephants. That was amazing. They were so close and even had babies with them. Is she scratching her leg? It was then time for breakfast. For that, we went to the Panamangala beach within Yala National Park. The place had toilets, sinks and even soap. It felt so great cleaning the dust off our skin. Breakfast was super yummy, Sri Lankan and vegetarian. Plus, we had such a nice view of the beach. Breakfast time. Mm -hmm. After we saw all the other, all the animals. All the animals. Well, a leopard, I only saw the, the body and the tail, I couldn't see his head, he was already ah, going. No, the time I spotted him, was he was going out. But the black bear was cool, the elephant were amazing. I saw that. The kind of two count, super nice. Mm. Yeah? Then it was wow. Yeah. I don't know how you didn't see, I saw yeah, the right where. Yeah, but it took me a, a, a while like, to, to know where to look. It was then time to continue with the safari. The rest of the morning was also great and we kept seeing animals in a lushy and breathtaking landscape. Slowly the morning was ending and it was time to leave Yala National Park. To sum up, we took the morning safari which started at 4.30 am and ended around noon. The cost for it was around 115 euro for two. We definitely loved it and found that it was totally worth it. Once back in our accommodation, we left for our next stop, Mirissa. And if you want to save time planning your trip to Sri Lanka and later travel worry-free, we created a digital map with over 200 pins, including things to do, restaurants, accommodations, points of interest, trails, routes, and so much more. With this map, you will have all the information you need to travel in Sri Lanka. And guess what? It works on Android or Apple phones, as well as PCs. In bonus, you get lifetime access, as well as all the future updates. So, if you want to know more about our Sri Lanka travel map, we put a link in the description.